Hi guys, disclaimer lang, I wasn't supposed to upload this video because the quality is so bad. I had technical difficulties with the video and the audio. So kung makikita nyo, medyo pangit yung resolution nitong video na to because I had to edit it multiple times and then all the editing, basta um, naging pangit na yung itsura niya. So sabi ko, wag ko na kaya i-upload kasi ang pangit talaga. But ayun, nasasayangan ako so... Um, I hope you guys bear with me. I promise. This is the last time. I promise I'm gonna invest in vlogging equipment now when I get home to the Philippines. But anyway, this is basically a week in my life as somebody who is trying to balance med school and also content creating. So, I hope you guys enjoy! And I promise to do better next time, I swear to God. Last time na to na ganito kapangit yung quality ng vlog ko. I promise, I promise, I promise, I promise. ng mga case discussions ng buong section namin and usually what I like to do first is I like to cross out yung mga hindi applicable sa mga groups ko. So those are the things na hindi kailangan pagpreparean kasi ibang group yung naka-assign and ginagawa ko to para hindi siya masyadong naka-overwhelm pag tinitignan ko siya at saka para hindi ako nagpapanik masyado. Okay, so the first thing that I'm gonna do syempre yung pang Monday which is Med 2 ICD. So, kakatapos ko lang ng isang report, I will just shoot some products. So, sa mga case discussions na ganito, usually ang ginagawa namin, hati-hati pa rin kami sa responsibility ng paggawa ng PowerPoint. So, may naka-assign lang sa yung part. Pero, kapag magre-report ka na, random yung pagtawag sa yun ng professor. So, kailangan mo pa rin ararin yung mga parts na hindi mo ginawa para sure na hindi ka bangag on the day of the report. By this time, mga random time lapse na yung mga ginagamit ko. So, I'm not sure if magtutugma yung oras sa clock sa actual video. Pero, this is a rough approximate. Kung gano'n ko kabagal mag-aral, I have a lot of study breaks. So, don't judge me kapag nagtatagal ako ng 2 hours sa isang trance lang. And, warning lang, medyo messed up yung body clock ko. So, baka nagtataka kayo bakit ang random ng mga times na kumakain ako. But yeah, basically I just eat whenever I'm hungry and I also sleep whenever I'm sleepy. Hindi ko force yung sarili ko. So you can see right now, inaanto ako and then I ended up sleeping. <laughs> I woke up at around 2 a.m. exactly when John called and here is a little conversation we had about my gift for his birthday. <laughs> Knowing you either magsasawa ka lang or mag-upgrade ka ulit. Hindi ko ito, hindi na mag-upgrade. Okay na, masaya na ako. Kasi ito na yun. Whatever! Parang, <laughs> Fake parang news! Parang yung bike na to, parang ikaw, Erika, parang... Ito, siya na. <laughs> parang gano'n. Alam ko ba't mo sinasabi oh, yan? Bakit? Mali! Bakit? <laughs> Oo oh, naman. Eh, ikaw, priceless cake. Wow! Napaka-fake mo, John! Napaka-fake mo Ako kahit mo lang bike, basta na dito ang susaya ako. Uy, sige. Balik natin yung ba bike. Uwi na lang ako. Pambili na ng ticket ko pa uwi! <laughs> Back and forth. <laughs> Bye! Bye, loves. Alis ka na? Mm -mm. And it's back to reality again. So, sanay ako dati na nag-aaral ako sa mga coffee shops kasi kailangan ko ng kasama mag-aaral. Kailangan may kasama ako na nagdudusa din. And ito yung mga usually kong nakakasama. So, virtual na lang kami nag-aaral ngayon. So, inabutan na naman ako ng araw. Nasa stress ako tuwing nakikita ko na yung araw. But, finally, nakatapos na ako ng tatlong dyan so far. 
So I decided to study again for another subject naman which is med 2 na medyo mahaba-haba yung coverage. And yes, kahit lunch break, kahit kumakain ako, nag-aaral pa rin ako kasi sayang yung oras, girl. So, makakatapos ko lang maligo and my classes are starting in a few minutes. I just checked the schedule today and hindi naman siya ganun ka-eventful. Today is not gonna be very stressful. Puro lang kami lectures today in med to BEMED and also plastic surgery. Meron lang kami isang presentation for med to pero I don't think I'm gonna be called kasi ako na yung natawag last week. So, sana naman, di ba, mag-rotate. Iba naman yung matawag na yun. So, first up is our med to lecture. At nakinig ako habang naguhugas ng mga baso at pinggan. So, for me, ito lang yung biggest advantage ng online classes kasi you get to do two things at the same time. Pero hindi rin nagtagal kasi... Sobrang nakaka-frustrate kasi just ko po, Lord, yung attention span ko pang 2 years old lang. Wala pang 10 minutes, sobrang nabobore na ako, lalo na pag hindi ko nasimulan yung lecture. Tinatamad na ako makinig, so baka mag-aral na lang muna ako para di sayang na oras. So dahil hindi rin ako makafocus, nag-aral na lang ako ng pang-quiz. At ngayon, magkikase discussion na kami. Hindi mo nakasado lang ako. Umaasa ako na hindi na ako matatawag ngayon. Yes, okay. Tapos na yung group namin mag-report and hindi ako natawag. Thank you God, hindi ako natawag kasi hindi ako napag-prepare for this ICD. So, habang nag-report yung kabilang group, mag-e-edit na ako ng video presentation namin for IMATI. Um, I forgot na kung ano yung meaning ng IMATI, kung ano yung um, sinisignify ng abbreviation na yun. Pero basically, it's for natural disaster planning. So, ang na-assign na kayo sa amin is nag-collide yung dalawang LRT. So, what can you do to treat yung mga na-accidente mga pasyente? How to triage them? How to prevent occurrences like this in the future? So, gumawa kami ng video presentation. Mag-edit na lang ako ngayon and hopefully tapos ko na siya after one hour. After that, I just ate dinner. And I listened to my online classes and more lectures and then I studied until it was finally time to sleep again. So good morning, nakatulog na ako kahapon. Hindi ko natapos lahat ng kailangan kong aralan. Nakakatatlong trans pa lang ako out of five, hopefully. Hindi ko pa nakikita yung dalawa, hopefully. Sobrang ikli lang nila para maaral ko sila habang leg ma. Ayun, nasa stress na ako, pero... Um, meron pa namang time, meron pa namang um, two hours ngayon to um, review sana kung kaya. Anyway, so ayan, mag-aaral na ako. Advertising himself as a dog. So, 7 p.m. ngayon. So, hanggang ngayon. Sorry. So, hanggang ngayon, di pa ako naliligo. Nasa stress ako kasi may quiz. Feeling ko sayang yung oras ko kapag naligo pa ako. So, baka after the quiz na lang ako maligo, which is like mga 11pm pa dito. So, patapos na yung araw, doon pa lang ako maliligo. Perks of online classes. Huwag niyo ako i-judge. Alam ko ganun din yung ginagawa niyo. This eye bags though. Ang lala niya, sis. Sobrang nakakawala ng freshness tong vlog na to ah. Feeling ko sobrang haggard ko lang the whole week. But, this is the reality of med school. So, it's not always gonna be good times and all. Okay, one more break. I have one more trance to go. I can finish this. So, we're gonna take the quiz in a few minutes. And kahit nag-quiz kami araw-araw mostly, Iba pa rin yung kabako dito kasi this is gonna be our first long quiz. 
So, more than 40 items, I think, yung magiging number. Sana hindi magloko yung internet ko. Yun talaga yung kinakabahan ako. Pero, anyway, natapos ko naman yung mga trances. Hindi lang ako nakapag-second read, pero na-digest ko naman yung information. I think. I think. So, um, while waiting for the time, mag-sample muna ako para lang makagain ako ng confidence and para makapag-practice test ako. So, ayun. Kinakabahan ako. Sana okay lang yung maging result ng long quiz ko. Yun. Um, excited na rin pala ako maligo. <laughs> init na init na ako. Gusto ko na maligo. Pero, after the quiz, hindi na ako kabado for sure. So, um, mas masaya maligo pag hindi ka kabado. So, tapos na ako sa quiz ko for today. So, happy na bawasan na yung load. Right now, nagpipilia class yung laptop ko sa labas kasi nandito ako sa loob. Maliligo na ako. Iniwan ko na lang siyang nakabukas doon kasi nagpapresent lang naman yung mga kaklase ko ng video presentation nila. And speaking of video presentation, I just wanna show a clip of the video presentation that I edited along with my other subsect mates. Tuwing kaming lima yung magkakagroup, sobrang bare minimum lang lagi na ginagawa namin. Kasi wala kaming pakialam kung ano lang kaya namin. Hindi na kami mag-twice the effort. Pero ngayon lang, ngayon lang kami gumawa ng effort for this project. So I just wanna share a clip um, of our PDA project. Minsan lang kami mag-effort, so pagbigyan nyo na ako. Good day! We are subgroup 1, and this is a physical examination video demonstrating palpation of the anterior and posterior chest to assess symmetry and tactile fremitae, auscultation of the... After classes, I just had dinner and then nagkaroon ako ng very quick meeting lang about work and then after that, I felt kind of burnt out and I didn't want to study so I decided to practice for my Toyota racing games. At this point, I just really wanted to sleep already kasi wala talaga ako sa mood pero meron kaming biglang instructions to do a um, journal appraisal for our general surgery so wala tayong choice we have to do that first and then I couldn't sleep after that so I just ended up studying I had some free time before my classes so I practiced racing again and then I finally went to class while cooking my breakfast. So, we have quiz na kami in 7 minutes again for BEMED. Naman ngayon. And I just want to say na sobrang nage enjoy ako mag aral ng BEMED or it's behavioral medicine. Para rin siyang psych. Parang ganun yung mga um, katumbas niyang subjects. Kaya yun yung in-advance na aral ko talaga nung weekend pa lang kasi yun yung ine-enjoy kong aralin. Pero ang problema ko sa subject ito, sobrang hirap nila magpa-quiz. So, sana okay yung quiz ko ngayon. And now, here I am having classes again while I'm having my lunch or my dinner. Honestly, I'm not so sure anymore. Pero, yeah, mag-report pala ako. So, um, this study was a retrospective single-center cohort study. And then after that, I had my final class for neuro. And then I studied again all night with my study buddies. Medyo mahaba yung coverage nito. Tsaka hindi ko to hilig aralin. Kasi for me, I think it's one of the most uninteresting subjects. Pero that's just a personal opinion. But yeah, I studied gyne and pedia. Well, not really so much on pedia, pero you get my point. <laughs> 